telling you about them for months now. Those smash and grab robberies at jewelry stores across the Bay Area. But tonight, investigators say they have arrested a crew of six young men responsible for the crimes from San Jose to the East Bay, even Los Angeles. NBC Bay Area's Robert Honda joins us from East Ridge Mall with details of the robbery operation. A security officer stands guard at the J and Huss jewelry store, and it's easy to understand why. This is video from last month when a masked, often armed robbery crew used sledgehammers and tools to bust through glass display cases to steal thousands of dollars in jewelry. In all, the store was robbed three separate times. We talked to the owner off camera, who told us he was relieved by the arrests. Police say it's not as unusual as it might sound. When a group of suspects like this identify uh, a target and they were able to get a significant haul, more than likely they return. The list of possible victims could get long. This surveillance video is from a January smash and grab at the Joyeria Martha Jewelry Store on Story Road in San Jose, one of at least three San Jose robberies this crew is being blamed for. Police say these six young men, ranging from 18 to 20 years old from various parts of the Bay Area, were caught after a long-term multi-jurisdictional investigation with help from various police agencies, including U.S. Marshals and Daily City police who were in on the arrests April 14th. Investigators also say they seized firearms, including two assault weapons, gun manufacturing equipment, and one homemade gun converted into an automatic weapon. We're seeing this proliferation. I mean, we're talking about this almost weekly, right? A another crime involving firearms, involving a, a ghost gun. The quick repair jewelry store, also in Eastridge, was hit in a smash and grab robbery in December. Even though police have not yet connected this robbery to this particular crew, the owner is just glad robbers got caught. That was great news. That's a good sign of release. Uh, I'll happy to hear. I'll cry. Yes. These are long, very complicated investigations. Our robbery detectives continue to do an excellent job in identifying these folks and then subsequently arresting them. Police say they expect to make more arrests, including focusing on the people who take the stolen goods to sell as well as those who buy them. In San Jose, Robert Honda, NBC Bay Area News. Robert, thank you. A